my people, all my Jamaican supporters across the diaspora and locally, and all the rest of people in the rest of the world that is supporting my channel, Speak My Mind Entertainment. God is good, God is great. As I said, we're going up just like age. We're not coming down. Well, you want to see today, I'm going to do some tilapia fish in sorrel barbecue sauce. Yeah, and these are the fish already marinated from yesterday. Well, I'm now going to put on some rice. I'm just going to serve with some rice. Here I have my barbecue sauce. And I pour a little soil from the gallon. The amount I want to use. Here I have my margarine, my seasoning, and stuff. Uh, most time you see these recipes, most times you might try these recipes and they don't taste right, but the difference in these recipes, you can see a recipe, you know, but guess what? It's the application of the recipe that makes it taste right. Because you see the recipe, but there is a way to apply the recipe. One, I might, okay, fry my fish, yes. You now might do the same thing as frying the fish, but the sauce is where the trick is. So you might fry the fish and then now you mix the sauce, everything up and put in the pot one time. Probably the way to do it is after you fry the fish, you simmer your fish down in your seasoning and stuff. Then now you make your sauce and glaze your fish with your sauce. Or if you want to pour your fish, the sauce over your fish, you pour it. But the trick is oh, you apply your recipe. It's not the recipe. You might apply the recipe the wrong way so you get a different taste from the way you're supposed to. So stick with me and you'll see how I do it. Tilapia fish in sorrel barbecue sauce. Getting my rice washed. And always remember people, try to wash your rice as clean as possible to get out most of the starch. Yeah, wash your rice until you see the water from the rice is actually like this from the pipe, clear. You might not get it this clear, but try to get it as clear as possible. That seems to mean you wash most of the starch out. So stick on chew with me. Yeah, my people, so the rice is on now. So, time to get to the fish. Yeah, so a little piece of garlic in your oil and a little piece of pepper while your oil hot. Yeah, to fry out in your oil. So you will see the procedure. Tilapia fish in barbecue sorrel sauce. Okay, there you have the sorrel here, the sauce there. So I will just show you the procedure as I go along. Just remember, continue to speak my mind. So you continue to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Don't afraid to speak your mind, people. Speak it as it is, okay? Tell a friend to tell a friend. If you have not yet subscribed, just go hit that subscribe now and subscribe to the channel. Speak my mind entertainment. Just my people. To change the pot, you know, because the next pot is kind of stick. I'm mean, gonna want the fish to mash up, and I'll just change it to a non stick pot. Yes, yeah, stick on my fish is on the fire. Yes, my people, that is it. Stick on my entertainment. Continue, my people, support the channel. So I'll go up like age. Yeah. So I started to prepare the sauce, as I said, barbecue sauce. Yeah, I'm going to pour some of my sorrel in the sauce now. Well, my people, the sorrel and the barbecue sauce combine this now. I'm going to grate a little piece of ginger, a little pep. Yeah, 
this is still enough for her. I have one more to fry out for this. So, let's stay tuned. Go work closer. Keep my mind entertainment. Like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Let's go see it. Pour my little ginger now in my strainer. I have to eat that flavor, you know? Yeah. Mm hmm Prepare the seasoning. See sauce right there. So part time now for seasoning. Yeah. So let's try it up. Call off the seasoning then. Then get some flavor out of it. And as I said people, having a recipe is one, you know. But the, 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 the thing about the recipe, you have to know how to apply it whatever you are used in the recipe. If I like all this now, you now go on to put in the fish and then you throw the sauce over it. Too much fire on the sauce is going to take away the flavor and the taste. So you put in your fish, you can see quality of the sauce over it if you don't want to use no, no, no extra water. Yeah, and make your fish go and steam a little bit. Then now, two minutes after, you throw on your sauce. I make your sauce here for another two minutes and you're good to go. So as I said, too much fire on the sauce, I will take away the flavor and the taste. So stick with me and you see what I want. Speak my mind entertainment. As I said, you use a little of the sauce instead of water. Yeah, and a little piece of butter. You notice now, I reserve some of the sauce to chew over it. So that sauce is going to stay for probably a two minutes. Then I put in the fish and then throw the rest of this sauce over it. So too much fire won't take away the flavor and the taste. Stick and tune for the final product. Speak my mind entertainment. Like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you all for continuing to support. Who are not supporting us yet, continue to view the videos. Go and hit that subscribe button. And remember to leave a comment. Yes, my peeps. A little sauce now over it. Just a little more sauce over it, my peeps. Yeah. So, stick and chew it, my people. See it when it comes out in the plate. Just remember, like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Speak my mind in particular. Yes, my people, this is a finished product. As you know, I'm not too fussy with the vegetable, just like my daughter. It's a fair bowl, yeah, so she likes fair when it's gravy over rice. Yeah. See that? Mm hmm. Tilapia fish in sarrel barbecue sauce. Yeah. With white rice. That's how she like it. Probably not ask how oh, no see me and share from my daughter this long this one. Most time I just take she fear food out of the picture you know, because too she want gravy over rice, it look away, you know. But speak my mind people, continue to support the channel. Please and thanks. Thank you for watching. God is good, God is great. I'm out.